Well, hello, good people. Mark Holmes here, and as always, I appreciate each and every one of you guys. So we all know that the NFL, there was a lawsuit um, against the NFL that started in 2016, as long as Dak Prescott has been in the NFL. Um, basically, um, getting the NFL charged with basically overcharging for um, Sunday ticket, okay? And for me, I had Sunday ticket um, I got it originally, I guess, about four years ago, and the I ended up having to buy DirecTV. I didn't like having DirecTV's internet, so I ended up having Verizon TV um, at my house along with having their internet because I had you know, ultra-high-speed internet. Their satellite internet sucked, but I basically spent you know $100 a month a year for two years minimum time when you signed up for it just so I get the Sunday ticket. And then that was an additional $300 on it. So I think about how much money it costs me to be able to have direct TV. And the thing was, if you got rain, a good rainstorm, it would mess up. And the last year that direct TV had it, you had games that were just messed up. And so it was just like, why are we paying for this? Now the lawsuit originally ended up being a 4.9 judgment for the plaintiffs. The NFL, just um, a month ago, thought each team was going to come up with about $420 million to um, basically uh, try and get the, the judgment overturned to appeal it. Well, the NFL, the judge threw it out. So now, the dispute was that Apple TV and Amazon wanted to get Sunday ticket but be able to customize it so that way you could get just like single team uh, packages. NFL said, no, we want to keep this as a premium product. Now, I don't know how long they've been in the process of working this, but we have some really great news um, as far as Sunday ticket goes um, because it is more of a premium now. Um, unlike when DirecTV had it, nothing changed and you could just get the games. This is going to be more... Um, more customizable. Let's look here what we're talking about because you're going to be able to change up uh, different angles that you're watching the game. You're going to be able to customize it more. You're going to be able to do more things with it. So this is a multi-view preview of some of the things that you can do. So yeah, this will definitely be able to enhance what we're doing. Now for me, um, I like Sunday Ticket because... Um, I like to watch Philly 500 meltdown. I like to cut, keep up with the Giants and um, Washington. So I end up having, you know, multiple TVs. In fact, I need to, um, because I took some of the TVs that I had at the man cave and I brought them down here, I need to get some more TVs and start getting my man cave set up and figure out if we're going to be doing games outside or inside. But we've got the 75-inch TV inside, and so we'll get a couple of 50s to go along with it so that way we'll be able to really uh, watch and cover the games. But definitely this will be nice to be able to um, see all of these different angles and things like that and customize it. So, um the whole thing will be is, I guess when I have like three or four TVs going, is you need them all to be on a different remote because you mess up with one and then it messes up the others. But we'll see how it goes. All right, good people. Good news. You get a little more bang for your buck from Direct TV, excuse me, from Sunday Ticket on Facebook. Oh, God. There's so many different platforms. On the YouTube. Jeez. I need more coffee. Peace out.